Welcome to my workroom. During the last tutorial we learned to accurately take the measurements of the body that we want to dress and to populate the measurement chart with these measurements. Now we are going to use the measurements on the chart to construct the torso block which is a flat two-dimensional blueprint of the body you want to dress as it is represented by the measurements on the measurement chart. The process is to move from the body that you want to dress to establishing a torso block pattern that perfectly fits this particular body. This block pattern is then used to create all the other garment styles that we design for this body. The aim and outcome of this tutorial therefore is to create a torso block that perfectly fits the body that you intend to dress with its finally adjusted pattern set. This torso block, which now represents the shape of the three-dimensional body, will be used as the foundation to create patterns for all garment designs, except pants where the patterns go in between the legs. Before you start the pattern for the torso block, you will need to familiarize yourself with the equipment that you will need in order to make this pattern. We shall first construct a diagram for the torso block according to the measurements from our measurement chart. With the use of this diagram, we will then create patterns for both the back and the front of the torso block. We shall then use these patterns to cut in a muslin or an unbleached calico fabric and then sew it. Once the toile is sewn, you will then fit it on the body that it was designed for. Adjustments are then pinned and the patterns adjusted accordingly where required. I'm now going to take you step by step through the construction of the torso block diagram. I advise that you download the written instructions and place it on the side next to your workstation so that you can step by step follow the process as we construct the basic torso block. 